Well, we're going from this right here, factory dash panel, where the throttle cable is right, where's my finger, right there, and the ignition switch is way back here, and the choke is way over there. So what we're doing now is we're going to go where the ignition switch is here. And I've got it out right now and finish this up. I'm doing the last part of the installation. Had to remove the switch one more time. And I'm changing the light location because I moved the throttle a little bit further forward. And I'll explain that when we do the, the real time video. But see this bracket right here? That's part of the throttle bracket right here. So we're going to remove, instead of remove this, we're going to relocate this light switch. And this light switch right here happens to be for the headlights. This one is for emergencies. And this one is for tail. Here's where the clutch will be. And tachometer. This is the voltmeter. There is the hour gauge. Uh, let's see, what have I got here? Whoa! Threw that on the floor, whatever that is. And let's see. And that's going to be... Ah! That's right, I moved the voltmeter. I moved the voltmeter from here to here. And that'll be gas gauge up there. So, we'll have gas gauge, tachometer. I may move the gas gauge here and tachometer over there. It really doesn't matter where you put it. But all your real pertinent items will be ignition, choke, throttle, and your clutch to engage your, your blade, your blade clutch. So that's where we're at right now. Hopefully for the end of the day we'll have this thing ready to go. But it's, uh, I think it's warmed up to like 28 degrees inside the shop here. So uh, to be honest with you, I'm thinking possibly um, come back out when it warms up a little bit more. Haven't turned the heaters on, and as you can see, guys, the little heaters out here basically are they are. It's just little milk house heaters right there. So uh, bear with me. We'll uh, get this done, fire it up, drive it around, and uh, and even that might take a day or two before we get outside with this thing. But we'll uh, we'll show you what we got when it's all done, and then we'll uh, go back and we'll build the final version of this. Where everything is exactly where it belongs when we get all the parts and pieces in. So, again, the fuel gauge is not in there yet. We'll be making this out of the uh, yellow, like this grass catcher scallop block off plate. This is that high density. Even with it less than 28 degrees out here, that thing's still flexible. And uh, didn't break it, huh? I should have. <laughs> so anyway, that's where we're at, and we'll give you another update just as we get a couple more things done. I'm going to get in the house and warm up a little bit. Y'all come back and see me now here. Max is the garage in my home.